Are you ready for intensity? This is the final part of Let's Play Mega Man. I'm the Wii guy, and I'm here with Ron Moore and Bear13 again. Yay. And welcome to Let's Play Mega Man. This is Ron Moore. I'm with Wii guy and Bear. What? Shut up. Shut up. <laughs> Steroid rage. <laughs> wow. All right, okay. more of this ECW music in ECW Castle. Indeed, but I can't help it. This, this is too perfect. We gotta restart the recording. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> we gotta mess it up. That's how we do it here. No. Oh, hey, Gutsman. Yeah, Gutsman is, uh... I don't know. I don't know. Why is he there? What's going on? Are we What's going the, on? Are we in the Robot Master Museum? <laughs> yeah, the National Robot Master Museum <laughs> of Art. Yeah. Go, go, don't give a fuck, don't give a fuck, I don't give a fuck, I don't give a fuck. Hey, watch your mouth. We don't curse here on the S2K. Oh, yeah, you're right. God damn it, I'm so fucking sorry. <laughs> shit, damn it, fuck, god, <laughs> shit. <laughs> oh, shiny right. star. You got the ninja, ninja star. <laughs> which helps heal, which, I mean, heal, or just restores everything, all my stuff, so we're good to do it, we're good to do it, we're good to do it, we're good to the ECW star. My head hurts from him. Thanks a lot, <laughs> wee guy. Yeah, wee gal. Oh, welcome, honey. Wee bitch. chun ri <laughs> Oh, yeah. I am rear chun really good because I beat Bob. <laughs> I blew Bob Man up. Chun really need to shut up. All right, Fireman. I'm, are you ready to put the fire out? Fire. Fire. <laughs> no. <laughs> fire. <laughs> fire. Fire. <laughs> you guys really are like Beavis and Butthead. <laughs> We are. <laughs> I feel like totally just blew up this guy on fire. And uh, Jeff, Jeff is Stewart. <laughs> Stewart, I don't know. Uh, uh, run away, run away. Okay, oh. we're good. We're safe. <laughs> he ran. <laughs> All right, we're gonna fight Gutsman. <laughs> Todd, Todd, Todd is Todd is J Man. <laughs> Todd. <laughs> yeah, that's perfect. You fellas, or hey, kill ever? No. You don't know anything <laughs> about beers, but <laughs> no, I'm thinking of Jamin as being the old. I'm oh. thinking of Jamin as being the old guy. That's what I'm saying. I meant oh, okay. to say that Jamin is that guy, but I was just all I just started doing him, thinking that. <laughs> I know the characters, goddamn it! I, I I know it. And uh, <laughs> ja Janelle is Daria. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'd hit that. <laughs> all right, here we go. Such a retard. Final battle with a spaceship. Oh, wait. Spaceship invaders! I don't know. Like that Rush song. Yeah. Oh, oh. Song yeah, right. Pew, 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 pew. Use the pause trick. Yeah, you used it before. <laughs> yeah. I didn't want to use it this time. <laughs> I felt like doing it just as <laughs> normal. God damn it, Bear. <laughs> Shoot him, shoot him. <laughs> I'm trying. Uh, I'm trying to find the can. Uh. I'm trying harder. Shut up! You're not the one out peeing. I said harder. Oh, what the hell was that? This is so weird. Physics, man. Or the game programming. It's weird. It's Oh, that was shocking. It's electrifying. Ow. <laughs> Are you fighting the rock? You jump fighting into the most electrifying, electrifying man. And Dr. Wild does a double on people's eyebrow. Oh, god damn it. <laughs> we have failed. It's just failure sauce up the butt. Gam damn it, J-Man. Get Mega Man. <laughs> 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 to go through those assortment of names to figure out who I was trying to say. Goddamn blue bomber. <laughs> Alright, got it, Bear. Get the idea. But what I don't get is what the hell is he supposed to be flying? This doesn't make sense. Tom Machine dildo. <laughs> yeah, very, that's the most elaborate dildo I've ever seen, ever. Such a. Goddamn it, Bear. Oh well. <laughs> Electrical flying electman power! Go. Let's go. Ah, you son of a bitch, Wily. Uh, take that Venus schnitzel and shove it up your scheisen. The scheisen holen. I don't know. Da. <laughs> da da, yeah, yeah, yeah. Da. What? 
No! <laughs> I don't know what's going on anymore. The power is in your hands! Mega Man! And... And... Oh, come on, come on, let's do this. And boom, goes the dynamite. <laughs> or it's spaceship, whatever it's supposed to be. Yay! We did it! We saved him! Oh, wait. <laughs> do, do, cheer for Finish music. him. Finish him. Dun, 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 dun. Finish him. Yay. Points, 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 points. Why does Yay. everything you defeat, it seems like you get stuck in the background. I think that was just supposed to happen. Yay, we did it. We ended the evil domination of Dr. Wily and destroyed... For peace. now. <laughs> and destroyed... And destroyed the world to peace. Oh. The never ending battle continues yeah. until all destructive forces are defeated, as we will make eight more of eight more games in this series. <laughs> yeah, nine more. <laughs> Milk it for all that it's worth. Eight. Fight Mega Man! Fight for everlasting Mega Man games! Yeah. That's really what it is. Yay! Happy endings are happy. Stay. Just like in hands! I mean staff. I like staff. <laughs> you like the staff. AK you got staff AK forty seven? You just got staff, bitch. <laughs> you just got Mega Man. Up the ass. Tom Pawn. So weird. It's Tampon. weird. Tom No, Tom. <laughs> Ina Fuki. Ina Fuki. And Ina. Uh, never mind. It's the guy who created Mega Man, basically. Ina Fucky. Ina. F whatever. Five Dara. Saki Saki. <laughs> I got an HMD in programming. <laughs> oh, now he's become one of the characters in River City Ransom? <laughs> Not really. Wait, what the- how the hell do you pronounce that sound programming name? Okay, that was- Oh, easy. that's- that's- that's discrimination or bad or something. They got the, the Twin Towers there. Ooh. Oh. Mega Man Towers. <laughs> he did it! He's a real boy! He's a real boy! <laughs> he's a real man now! Hee <laughs> hee! Pinocchio Man. Pinocchio, man. Oh my god, that'd he be great. He has to keep lying to where his nose grows and hits you. Oh, Phil. Uh, his, I uh, thought his dick would grow every time he tells a lie. <laughs> you grow. No, his uh, M I weapon do. gets shorter. <laughs> his M weapon that shoots the bar, he gets shorter. Goodbye. <laughs> All right, here he is, the Les Discus. Let's Discus of mid mid Midget Man. Let's get <laughs> Mega Man. Midget Man. Midget Man. Small, but yet very powerful. How about getting on with his commentary, man? We mean the let's no. discuss. Yeah, of course. It's gonna, we're going to do that. Let's discuss. But, I mean, yeah, let's just, let's just shut up. No. All right, let's do this. So, Mega Man. Mega Man is an amazing game. Don't you agree? <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yes, it really is an undeniable classic of the NES library. And it has to be pretty much the first... I think it is pretty much the first game I played by Capcom. And that I knew... It, and really, it is just ECW, ECW. Yep. I mean, the level design is just great, and the graphics are superb, and the controls and gameplay are just, you know... Superb. They're, they're well-programmed, and the music is amazing, of course. I always have to give the highest props to the music, because really, I always enjoy that the most in the game. And this one is, an, is no doubt undeniably one of the best of the Mega Man series. Well, that's kind of debatable. I would either say it's either 1, 2, or 9. Because 9 is pretty amazing, but... This is 1! We're talking about number 1. The Uno... Uno... Uno. Number... Uh, numero... Uno. Machismo. <laughs> yeah, and, uh... This game is just really... Just awesome, and... Really hard, too. At first, after a while, as you saw... Or, as you saw, I pretty much eased through this game. Dying a few times, but hey, it's one of those games that even though, probably no matter how many times you play, you're, you're gonna still die, because the, the the game design just gets you, and it just, mm, it's got that perfect, it hit the G-spot, man, it hit the G-spot on everything, <laughs> and it's just, well, no, that'd be more for Mega Man 2, because that, that one really hit the spot, but this was like the beginning, the first, like, mm, the first taste of what was to come of Mega Man. And pretty, and it's great. It's great. It's all I gotta say. It's amazing. High props. I, or high, 
High praise. I would probably have to give Mega Man... I really have to give it a 10 out of 10. I mean, I, there's not much flaws I can find with it. I mean, other than for some people, they would probably just scored a 9 or 8 because of how difficult it probably is. But really, you can't always fault a game on that. This really just has it right down to just really good level design. And if you die, it's because you suck. It's because you suck. You suck. No, I'm just kidding. So, yeah, 10 out of 10. Ronnie? Um, Mega Man 1, I mean... It's a good game, but compared to the other games in the original series, it really is uh, mediocre. But it's not a bad game. Um, I just actually I played Mega Man two, three, and four and five first. I believe before I ever picked up part one, um, and so that's why it was like, eh, this is not as good as the others. But but for what it is, I mean, pretty innovative for its time in a way. I mean, you cho- choose your uh, the stages you get to pick first. Uh, who you want to fight first, but you got you're supposed to pick them in the right order. Um, and I mean, the gameplay uh, is pretty good. And I, and I remember on the box it said uh, "state of the art graphics." I guess that for that time it was state of the art, um, but it came out '87. So yeah, I mean, um, pretty good graphics. And the music, music is okay, but it is not as good as the the rest of the series and the original series. Um, the Dr. Wally stage three and four music is pretty awesome. Um, yeah, but, and the challenge, real challenging, even though it seems kind of unfair challenging. But, uh, I mean, at the same time, it's still a good challenging. It's not like BS challenging or anything. But it's not a bad game. But, I mean, compared to uh, the other Mega Man games, it really, uh, it really is kind of lame. I just really haven't liked Mega Man 1 all that much. Um, but with that said... I don't think it's a bad game either. So I'm just going to have to give the score I'm comfortable giving it is a 7 out of 10. Hmm. Pretty different. But, I mean, mine is like, I mean, it's a 10 out of 10, but it's like kind of like a low 10 out of 10, if that makes any sense. I mean, really, for my re- kind of just let's discuss short mini review, I mean, I just don't find much, you know, nothing bad about this game. That's the thing. I mean... After playing it after a while, it may get simple, and but everything else still remains great. The graphics, the gameplay, the music. So really, it's it just it's it's st- it still stands the test of time with pretty much some of the uh, some of the other games of the series like two and three. Mm-hmm. But uh, mostly I had to mention like because uh, I still like to keep on my regime of like how I let's discuss. The other thing I left out was replayability, and really I could keep replaying Mega Man, but obviously I choose two over. One, but doesn't mean I want to play Mega Man again when it over just you know occasionally. Yeah. I, I also want to mention, of course, we gotta mention the box art as you as the weird old man on the cover. <laughs> yeah, really. That I mean, that's just uh weird. It's like same, they did the same thing with Mega Man Two, which is my favorite game of all time. But even as a kid, I'm thinking, what the heck is this? That's not Mega Man. It's some grown man want to be Mega Man for Halloween or something. I mean, it's like, you know, so, uh, but the Mega Man 1 box art is, I don't know what they were doing right there. I mean, he looks nothing like he does in the game, but oh well. I mean... And he, has, he has a gun, too. He doesn't have a freaking gun. He has yeah, a his arm, arm is the gun. <laughs> yeah. So I gotta say, the, uh, the, the difference in the, uh, European, of course, because all the region box arts back in the day were different, the, the European box art is pretty badass. Like, it shows him more as a teen, but he's still, like, Old, older, but he's pretty. It's pretty badass. Yeah, it's all hardcore, and Doctor Riley has this like, just anime old face, and it's kind of cool. Mm-hmm. But I gotta say, the European box art for Mega Man Two, just uh, go to Mega Man Two, is pretty amazing, pretty epic. I gotta say. I don't know if I it shows like that. it shows like a white Mega Man though for some reason, but he still looks pretty awesome. I gotta look that up. Yeah, but uh, oh yeah, I forgot about Bear. It's gonna start to end, but. Bear? Bear, do you have anything to say? I give it 4 out of 10. I don't really care for the Mega Man series in this game in particular. It doesn't necessarily hold back its play replayability this time, you know, in these years. And I prefer 2, 3, and 7 to 1. Really? 7? Yeah, I like 7. Yeah, well, we all have our preferences for, you know, games and certain series. I just so happen to like, you know, 1 a lot. All in all, I like the music. It 
looks fine for an NES game. And um, the, the music looks fine. <laughs> <laughs> I like the music, and it looks fine for an NES. Game. Okay, okay, let's hear the end. Uh, Again, four out of ten, and the only problem is, learn to shoot up, you twisted little fuck. Who, me? Mega Man. And I like the Mega Man series, except for that little blue guy who's in all the games. <laughs> I know, it's like, why don't they have, like, a like a red guy? They do, Proto Man. I'll choose, I'm the blue guy. <clears throat> and that's all I gotta say. <laughs> Great story, chap! <laughs> Hot story, sis. Well, all right. Let's start story, sis. Well, well then. This has been Let's Play Mega Man on the SE2K. It's been a wild ride with the Blue Bomber and J-Man, Ron, and Bear. Or just J-Man for the first two parts. And you guys for the, these last two. Yay. Yay! All right, so... This is the way you guys sing. I'll see you in, in my next LP. Yep. See you later. See ya.